still got it. You know, this game used to be more fun. <laughs> and you used to be younger. I'm dumber. What matters is, you're still just as fast. Because a slow pilgrim yeah, is a, a dead, dead pilgrim. pilgrim. Yeah, I know, I know. Get up here. I want to show you something. Shit, man. You're still strong. Thanks. It's good to see you, Spike. I mean, how long has it been? Far too long. But don't get all mushy on me now. Come. I want to show you something. Where are we going? You'll see. It's incredible. What's incredible? Most pilgrims don't last two, three years on the road. But you've been kicking around for what? Four years now? And you're still alive. So are you. I know. But I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right, right. Seriously. I wish I had as much energy as you. Got a new lead on Jane? Nah, trail went cold after New Paris. Which route did you take? Through Baines or Gary? Eh, Baines. What a shithole. Some five rickety huts left and a ramshackle fence. <laughs> Look at that. A beehive full of honey. Can't let an opportunity like this go to waste. Uh, no way. Oh, look around. If we're lucky, there's chamomile growing here, too. each other for a long time, but I'll still get pissed off at you if you don't hurry. Yeah. We've known each other for a long time, but I'll still get pissed off at you if you don't hurry. This'll do. Do you remember that old herbalist we helped escort to her village? Oh, yeah, the one that had that saying, uh... Remember, chamomile and honey are gifts that keep giving. Combine them and lucky you, you just might go on living. Come on, we're almost there. This is it. Come on. Wow. 
Everybody had a nice crib. Damn it, locked. I'll try to get through here. You check the other side. Take anything we could use. Yeah, sure. Empty. Yeah. Nothing here. Nothing in here. Party. Uh, but by then the GRE would have long since lost control of the virus. saying. If you're starting to worry about someone, it means it's time to go. I wonder how the wine tasted back then. Who do you voodoo? Hmm. Sounds familiar. And that's what they called art? celebrate the end of the world. Uh, they died on their own terms. Let's hope we get that lucky too. <sighs> I'll see what's upstairs. You check out the garden, okay? Okay. they had each other. She was classy. D. 
dearest Mary, I'm sorry I ran from you. They say that once the virus makes you turn, you're gone forever. That can't be true. I know you're still in there, underneath all that pain and disease. I'm coming to join you. No more running. God. Hey, come here. Check this out. Sit down, buddy. For you. A gift? A gift from the heavens, to be more accurate. I've just found it, by the owner's dead body. May it be of more use to you. Here. It's gone flat. <laughs> Look at you and your sophisticated palate. Drink. Who would have thought the end of the world could be so peaceful? Eh, at least until night falls. True. I wish Crane could have seen this. Wh who? Doesn't matter. I tracked down that guy for you. What? And you're only telling me now? <laughs> when I tossed you a beer, thought you'd guess right away we were celebrating. The guy's in Villador. Supposedly he knows something about Waltz. Villador? I saw him that close, huh? Hey, I, I got a favor to ask you. You deliver this to Gary, it's on your way. People don't like pilgrims there, but, but they pay well. <laughs> and where do people like pilgrims? Well, they're afraid of us. Everyone does their best to survive. Maybe. But when something needs to be transported through the hordes of infected, then suddenly they're knocking on our doors. All right. But you owe me one. No, not just one. So what about that guy? Well, I talked to him over the radio. He didn't tell me his name. Sounds like he's got something to hide. See that antenna on the hill? That'll help you contact the informant. He'll be listening for you at dawn on a frequency of 140.200 megahertz. Told him he'd hear from you soon. What does he want in return? Didn't say. But he didn't sound like the kind of guy who does things for free. I don't think that kind of guy exists. What? What about me? You're an old fart who likes racing me, and makes me ask around about his crazy girlfriend. Hey, hey, hey. She's not crazy. Jane's just maybe, well, a little hot-headed. And she's always getting herself into trouble. But if you could get a load of her... <laughs> Whoa, all right. Still too early in the evening for that sort of talk. Eyes. I was going to say eyes. Beautiful. Steely. Huge. Never heard anyone get so worked up about gray eyes. Because you don't know shit about the world, let alone women. Yeah, you're probably right. I'm telling you, I'll finally find Jane. We'll set up a house. We're gonna live there. No one's gonna drive us out. And I'll stop wondering like a moron. I'll drink to that. And that Waltz, what's his deal? Is he family? No, not at all. <laughs> then why are you looking for him? Will you tell me sometime? Yeah, yeah, one day. Well, <sighs> my time's up. So when will I see you again, huh? In another two years? Maybe. Take care, man. I hope you find that Waltz guy, or whoever you're looking for. And remember, 140.200 megahertz at dawn. The guy's waiting for you.
spiders.
Almost there. <clears throat> oh, it's already dark. It's time to hide somewhere for the night. It won't get any better than this. Broadcast station should be here somewhere. Someone moved them. Not long ago. It's been moved. Okay, let's give it a try. <sighs> this is it. The broadcast station. I gotta start the generator. Oh, it's dead. I need to connect it to power. Oh, 
Like now? No, when we're <laughs> old. No, Aidy. We need supplies. Everything's ready. It's so quiet. Where is everyone? Maybe they're all dead. <laughs> You're stupid. Let's go. Now. be all right. Wait here. Nothing good will come of this. Have you brought 12346? We were supposed to take the patients back to the city. Don't worry. They'll let us go soon. Edie, I'm scared. I'm here with you. You're safe with me. I know. Do what I tell you. separate us, this is how we'll always find each other. Time to contact the guy Spike was talking about. This is Aiden. 
I'm on frequency 140.200 megahertz. Hello? Aiden? Yes. I was supposed to get in touch with you. I thought you'd change your mind. Why are you looking for Waltz, Pilgrim? To find someone else. Her name is Mia. Fifteen years ago, we were in a hospital together and... I know who you're looking for, Aiden. You want to know why Waltz was doing those experiments on all of you. Why you are stronger, more durable than others. Now, I just want to find Mia. I've been looking for her since I left the survivor's camp. I... Can you help me or not? Maybe I can. Let's meet, Pilgrim. Where and when? Entrance to the metro tunnel by the bay. You can get inside the tunnels through an open GRE hatch. I'll meet you there. I take it you're not doing this for free. I have to leave the city, but I won't make it on my own outside. Take me to New Paris, and we're even. Along the way, I'll tell you everything I know. Over and out. Wait. I have to at least know if she's alive. She's alive. I'm going to the rendezvous. I'll see you later, Rita. It's Aiden. Can you hear me now? Loud and clear. I mean, you must be close. I swam across the lake. So, you've almost reached the tunnels. There's an entrance. The only one the GRE left when they sealed off the city. I'm coming from the other side. Hurry up. What's wrong? Entering the tunnels. Hey, can you hear me? I'll meet you soon. Here I come. Anybody there? Oh, 
shit. This doesn't look good. You bid me. A volatile. Lots of those fuckers in the sewers. You must get through the light quickly. Where's me? Uh, uh, later. We have to move. <laughs> Resist it. It'll pass. <laughs> Just stay strong. Here you are. We've been looking for you. Didn't have it on him. Let's go! I don't have the key. I swear! <laughs> I destroyed it. I did this on my own. Both be able to get it out. Where is it? I don't know what you're talking about. Let him go. You couldn't make us let him go, punk? I'd sure like to see you do that. Bring it! <laughs> Thank you. 
Who was that? There's no time. In my pocket. I left you something. What is this? A GRE access key. The peacekeepers, they found it. We cannot lose it. You were gonna tell me what happened to my sister. Where's Mia? You will go to Fisheye. There, ask for a girl named Lawan. Give that to her. With it and her help, you'll learn. You will learn everything. Understand? Protect it. If Waltz gets his hands on it, the whole city, everyone will die. Walt? Is Walt here? He is. Oh, they're coming. You hear that? Renegades, run! We'll go together. Take this. Hey, let's go. What the fuck? There's our lost lamb! And he's not alone! We can fix that. Yeah! <laughs> 
Looking for him. You we... idiot. He'll kill you if he finds you. Kill on! Fuck. Get to the vent. Quick. This way. You first. What are you doing? Waltz can't get the GRE key, remember? What? Let me out. I... Fish eye. The one. Let him go. Why did you betray me? This key is not yours. You can't... Where is it? Not really. You're only dying. Before zero hour, my grandfather raised horses. Beautiful rare breeds. I love them dearly. One day his most beloved horse fell off the slope and broke his leg. I thought Grandpa would help him. But he just pulled out his pistol and put it in my hand. He told me, you're doing it for him. Then he pressed my finger on the trigger. I screamed. I wanted my grandfather to die. But years later I realized what must be done must be done. You leave me no choice, my friend. <laughs> Someone's here. In the bed! Get him! Uh-huh. <laughs> 
He's moving. Hack on? Kill him, hack on. Kill him before I do it for you. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Relax. Breathe. <laughs> Seems he hasn't turned. Seems? Hack on, I don't want that here. You've come back to us. Blink if you understand. Ah! Fuck my head! <sighs> You were on the verge of turning, but UV light and inhibitors pulled you back. Uh, the bat helped too, of course. You're alive. Let's keep it that way. Guy almost kills us all and you're chatting him up? Girls, relax. They're frightened. You almost destroyed their workshop. We need to move out. Can you walk? But I... I don't understand. Where are we going? To a safe place. I gotta get to the fish eye. The fish eye? Without the biomarker, you won't get near it. What the hell is that? Biomarker. Monitors the disease's progression in the dark. That's your ticket into the city. Without it, uh, stepping out of the light is sort of a lottery. You don't know when you'll turn. You need a biomarker, and I know where to find one. Come on. Relax. Everything's under control. It'll be fine, hey? You're weak. Take a minute. Drink. Seriously? What next? Maybe we should draw him a bath? Sounds pretty cozy to me, ladies. Uh, maybe next time. Get banned, hack on. <sighs> she adores me. Why are you helping me? Let's get to know each other and find out. You go first. Where'd you get all those? None of your business. You're careful. Good. You live longer. You a real pilgrim? Or did you steal that badge? I'm a... I was, I was a pilgrim. An hour to dusk. I'm serious, Hakon. He's not staying the night here. Not even a pilgrim could get by without that. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Not bad. 
Where's the fish eye? The canteen is there, in the center, past the chemical dumps. Uh, I need to get there. Too bad. Only way to go is through the tunnel. They protect it like a portal to the fucking Valhalla. Near impossible to get through. Well, can you help me? You seem to be familiar with the city. I've lived in this city since before the world got fucked up. I could help you, but... You need a biomarker. You won't get far without it. Where are you from? Pretty far, I guess. About 2,000 kilometers. Oh, shit. How the heck did you not get infected? That's easy. Didn't let him bite me. Here it's different. Here we're all infected. Heard of Haran. They isolated Villador too. They built walls. They locked us in. It turned out to be the thing that saved us. And how do you get a biomarker? Uh, you can't get them. Unless you know the right people. And I do. Let's go. By the way, I'm Hakon. I'm Aiden. Nice to meet you, Aiden. Welcome to paradise. Over here. Oh, you do know the moves. I was in the military. Special unit? For seven years. I even liked it, except when I didn't. For insubordination, got blacklisted and they zeroed my bank account. I ended up driving a cab. Ouch. Now the mighty have fallen. <laughs> Fuck you. At least I got to know my way around the city. Oh, come on. <sighs> You're too weak. Without an inhibitor, you won't last. Didn't I smash everything in sight last time you gave it to me? That was just the first time. But then it gets better, if you survive, of course. Catch! You're telling me I could have died? If I hadn't given it to you, you would have died anyway. So, why are you helping me? I know people are generally scared of you guys, but one pilgrim saved my life. I was a pilgrim. Now I'm infected. It'll be much harder to travel. <laughs> then welcome to your new beginning, my friend. Check out this place. They're like treasure chests. Usually got good stuff in them. Check it out. I'll wait. People hide a lot of things in places like this. In case someone can't make it back to a shelter before dark. That. Crystals. Someone must have stashed them here. They formed after the chemicals were dumped on us. Some believe they delay infection. Folk superstition. So you don't collect them? Sure I do. Superstitious people pay a fortune for them. And I am always happy to take someone's cash. There's one specific chest I'm after. Come on, let me show you. Stop! 
So, you have an army here? Ugh, the peacekeepers. They treat people like that too. Watch out for them. They guard the tunnel you want to go through. Tell me more about them. They consider themselves righteous protectors. Uh, they are good at killing infected, so you got to give them credit for that. They're pretty efficient killers. Yeah, but their righteousness comes with a price. Always remember this. You either play by their rules, or you're fucked. Their protection of the bazaar is more like an occupation. I'll proceed with caution. Good. Though it might not help. The PK are a pain. Seriously riling up the bazaar, folks. The bazaar is a box of dynamite one spark away from blowing up. Hey, are we going? You uh, wanted to show me something? Sure. Follow me. No surprises. It's getting dark. They are about to wake up. Quickly, open the chest. In return, we'll get your biomarker. Fuck. Thieves. Wait. No, 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 leave it. Mess up that lock and everything's fucked anyway. Enough for a biomarker? Where'd you get that? I've been all over this city more than most, but even I haven't seen working GRE equipment for years. I can't say much, but a former GRE scientist, Dylan, gave it to me. A guy named Waltz killed him. And before he died, Dylan gave me the key to keep it from Waltz. It contains important information, apparently. I hope to find out more at the fish eye. We'll have to see, won't we? <sighs> Fuck me. We took too long. Plan B. Run like hell. Find the UV lamp. The bazaar. We can make it. Follow me. Quick. They're close. Go on. Stand in the light. Uh, Hakon, uh... Come on, open up now! Hakon, a howler's coming. Oh, fuck. Biomarkers. There's no time, we've got a howler on our asses. Biomarkers? Didn't you hear? Behind us! I said biomarkers. Here. And his? He's with me. I have to see his biomarker. Let us just inside the door at least. I need to see his biomarker. How about some electronics, huh? Fucker! 
Open up! Friends here, huh? Killian! Keep them busy! Killian! Fuck! Killian! Come on! Killian! I took over my body this morning and get killed! We're done. Trouble loves company. Back on, get us in there! I'm trying. Killian, I know you're there! <laughs> Is that all of them? I think so. Help me. We're oh, so fucked. Damn it, Gillian! Should have waited a while longer. Almost did. Didn't want to clean your guts off my doorstep in the morning. They've left. So can you. Oh come on! Stop being such a bastard already. Look at this. Where did you? That's rare. Invite us in, or it'll get even more rare. Who is this? I'm a pilgrim. Haven't been here long, have you? How did you get into town? I'll tell you everything. Just let us in. I waited for a pilgrim once. He was supposed to... Ah, oh, forget it. Doesn't matter anymore. What are you up to, hack on her? Huh? I gave him an inhibitor. He survived. Are you mad? He needs a biomarker. Don't have one. Bullshit. Seriously. <sighs> Motherfucker. The hospital then. I was hoping to avoid it. Always looking for an easy way, huh, hack on? I just need a UV lamp. I'll come back for you. Hold tight. Hack on. Why are you helping him, huh? Remember when we used to help people? Me? Sure. But I doubt you do. Stay here and rest by the lamp. Don't listen to that dumbass. <sighs> Idiot. 
We used to help the people, remember? Sure, I remember you, moron. The fucking captain and the mother of mercy all in one. funny. Did you make it? Almost. Biomarkers are at the GRE hospital. I'll be there shortly, but to get the job done, I need you to join me. Where should I go? With Killian's door to your back, you'll be pointing right at it. Hold the line. I know. Don't want to go up against any of those anytime soon. Once I was taking my second wife to the hospital. Never drove that fast in my life. Her waters broke three months early. You have kids? There was no saving that one. And other than that, none that I know of. Sorry. It's fine. What normal person would want his kids to see a world like this? The lock is broken. Don't worry. Find the old bus. A bus? At zero hour, a bus crashed into the hospital broke through the wall. You can use it to get inside. Since no one could get in, there's a good chance there'll be some markers left. Entrance. I marked a safe route for you. I'm waiting by the lobby. Hey! This way. Big building, huh? GRE took over quite a few of these for drug research. When it all got fucked, they grabbed research volunteers. They paid them loads of money. What was the result? A lot of shit. Just a little more. We don't have much time. Stay close to me.
You know how to open locks? Sure. Turn the key. What if you don't have a key? Hakon, I've traveled thousands of kilometers. You think doors are a problem for me? <laughs> okay, just checking. I think this room should have all the instruments you need, Maestro. I found some scrap. You can make lockpicks out of that. choice. Was forced to know my stuff. <gasps> oh, what the hell? Everything okay? Yeah. Are you sure? God. Talk to me. I'm just feeling woozy all of a sudden. It must be the infection. Don't give in. We'll get you a marker and you'll know where you stand. Yeah, thanks.
chemicals. Nasty shit. When they lost control of the virus, the GRE started spraying the whole city with that filth. Worked out great for them, huh? <clears throat> mm-hmm. I remember he was doing some kind of experiment. He wasn't the only one doing them. There were more cities like Villador, with walls cut off from the rest of the world. Many people were working toward a vaccine, Aiden. But, well, the world is full of shitheads. So... Can you climb up? Sure, just give me a sec. Hurry. We're running out of time. I can't make it. Wait. I've got an idea. Remember the cocktail I served you earlier, at the girls' workshop? Inhibitors. Exactly. You fell to the first floor. There's some GRE storage down there. Look for white, green crates. Inhibitors should be inside. If you take another dose, you should get your strength back. Thank you. 
only hid from us. I'm scared, Mia. Yeah, me too. And I'm younger. Don't be a chicken, Edie. What if the doctor sees us? He won't. Besides, he'd have to catch us too. Come on, don't back out now. Don't be a chicken, Edie. Took the inhibitor. Fantastic. Go back to the elevator. I'm waiting. You were gone a while. How are you feeling? I'm infected, but good to go. Yeah, that's great. Sorry about this. What? Sorry about what? <laughs> about that. On behalf of all its whores, bandits, and idiots, I christen you a citizen of Villador. <laughs> You're about to turn. Get into the light fast! Run! Close. Oh, what would you do without me, Pilgrim? Huh? I never wanted to become a Pilgrim. I just sort of fell into it. I roamed the country for another reason entirely. I'm looking for my sister. Sister? Yeah, her name is Mia. 
Fifteen years ago, we were in a hospital together. I think a guy named Waltz was experimenting on us. A lot of nut jobs in the world, huh? Yeah. I have to learn the truth. And then what? And then? What will you do once you find your sister? I'll find some place for us to live. You know, some place quiet. Gotta settle down somewhere now that I'm infected. Where will you go? Any place is better than this city. Ha, <laughs> come on, that's a pretty low bar. I'll find a place where people aren't afraid of pilgrims. Aren't afraid of me. It'd be nice not to have to run and hide for a while. I always wanted to catch fish. <sighs> fish are good. Well, I have a very specific plan. You look like someone with a specific plan. I'd like to live by the ocean. You know, it's supposed to be easier there. I always wanted to learn how to surf. What, you find a bunch of old postcards or something? Ah, don't laugh at my dreams, man. I know one thing. I have to get out of this city. It's killing me, right from the inside. Will you help me? The ocean's a long way from here. And we're both infected. People don't want pilgrims for their neighbors. Pfft, fuck people. I will help you with them. And you can help me survive on the road. You know the routes. You know how to survive out in the open. What do you think? We cover each other's asses. How does that sound? Okay, let's do it. Awesome. Deal. You won't regret this, Aiden. I promise. As for your goal, here's the situation around here. After the PK commander was murdered, they blocked the route to the center. They're trying to keep the killer from escaping. To get to Fisheye, we have to outsmart them. But I know when they change the night guard. That will be our chance. I'm gonna get the stuff we'll need for the passage. I have to suss out our odds. Meantime, take a look around. Live a little. Uh, come on. Let me show you something. Here. You'll need these. Take a look around the city. Old Villador, plenty of interesting spots to check out. You see the church? That's where the Howlers were after us. It's the center of the district. You can find notice boards with missing people around the city. One of them is near the church. Maybe somehow you'll find something about your sister there. And if not, just have fun. The world's already ended, right? How could things get any worse? I'll be back in touch when I've got a handle on things.
delicious. If I remember right, Grandma used to add a few chamomile petals. You're going. What a day. No frigging way I can do it. Very Five nice. years of learning and I'm pursuing easy. What's the problem? Hey, aren't you the pilgrim they wanted to hang? Matt, you were in luck there. I could use some of that luck. I'm Alberto's apprentice. Not for long, probably. It's the third time I'm taking a shot at this test. If I fail again, Craftmaster Alberto's gonna kick me out. What's this test about? Our goats. They're kept in cages because they eat crops. But life in cages makes them sad, and they give less milk. So I came up with the idea of a fence, energized with just a tiny bit of voltage. That would keep the goats under control, but let them produce more milk. I called this invention the electric fence. So what seems to be the problem with this invention of yours? I just need some electric parts. I'll dismantle them for resistors and other useful things. I'm missing a few parts, and they're not that easy to get. I'm worried I won't be ready on time. Maybe you could help me. If you find them for me, I'll give you one of my super cool inventions. Nothing to do with goats, I hope. Nah, something much more interesting. You'll see, as far as I know, they could be found in two places. One's an old hardware store on Fitzwilliam Place, near the water tower. Alberto says they'll be there for sure. But it's a dark place, full of turned creatures. You have to go there at night. And the other option? Whatever is left of military patrols. I know of one place south of Horseshoe, near the old electrical substation. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. But I, I can't promise anything. I would be very grateful. Man, I'm so thirsty. Hey, then. How's it been, kid? Should I tell you what's in life yet? Uh, I've been here and there. You know, the best part is always happening in the center. And that's where we're going. I have a plan for how to get there. I'll tell you everything on the spot. Meet me on the roof near the main metro station. Alive, and that's what counts. 